40 babies the size of a match head. Very small. But she's only got four teats, so it's the first four fastest, strongest electron to one of her four teats are the survivors. The rest would just fall down into the dirt and you wouldn't even realise they were there. And she would probably lick them up. But she's also got a backward basing pouch, just like the wombat. So if the babies are not latched on, a couple of them might happen to fall out while she's running through the bush. She won't go back and retrieve them, she'll just leave them there to die. So they start to emerge from the pouch at about four months of age. And this is when we can actually see if she's neglected any of the babies. And if she has, we'll take them off her and hand raise them. That way we're not going to lose any of the devils. So what the mother can actually do is when there is young on the teats, if there's not enough food around, she can actually just stop the milk supply to a couple of the teats and not worry about them babies. Oh, they still don't know at this stage what is actually causing the disease. Oh, okay. <laughs> So it can be transferred from one devil 